What's going on, shady people? Shady Penguin here, welcoming you back to another episode of our Fire Emblem Fates Conquest playthrough. We are in Power Log 1 right now. Uh, we have our friend Mozu here, who is now level 2, which I really love. Uh, I've heard great things about her, and I'm going to treat her as a valuable asset because that's exactly what she is. This is going to work out perfect. We're going to deal 22 damage, leaving him with 1 HP, meaning that Mozu can come through and uh, teach him a lesson if we move Effie elsewhere. Now, I would say let's move Effie... I'd say right here is the ideal spot. So let's go right here. Question mark? I mean, she can take hits for days. I don't want to attack this guy until we beat every last one of these. Every last one. I really don't know if Effie's worth, uh, Mozu's worth training. Or if I should just worry about building a relationship with someone. I mean, clearly she's building a relationship with Shady. So I think we're just going to rock out with that. For sure. Uh, there we go. There we go. Okay, right through the chesticles. I can dig it. Yeah, you're getting stronger. You are go getting stronger. Uh, she's in the line of fire right now, though, which is not good at all. Um, I think I need him in the line of fire instead. We're going to put Felicia right here because they support each other like lovebirds. And then I'm actually going to throw Arthur. Oh, darn it. Can't reach it. Can't reach. Okay, then we'll put we'll put our healer right here. Because no one can reach, reach her anyway. Yes. See, we didn't want Mozu getting attacked. But there's going to be some nice support here. Never mind! Silas is going for the second crit! Oh my goodness. In the last episode, Silas also got a crit. He looks like he is going to be super promising. Uh, that's, for, that's for sure. That's for sure. I wonder if the enemy, the king that's 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 championed over there, I wonder if he just refuses to move. Like, it's a possibility that he refuses to move. I wouldn't doubt it. Like, even if I were to put uh, Felicia right here to attack, would, would he just stay still? He might. I don't know. Maybe the power logs are easier because we're doing, I feel like I'm impressing some people on the internet right now with these last two episodes. Could be totally wrong. I kind of want to let Effie get this level up. But I'm super obsessed with, with this happening. So what we're going to do... I really want Effie over here. Which means that I want you... You're not even in range to get attacked, man. We can heal you up. I know we're wasting our staff. Wasting, quote unquote. But we have the shop now that we can access. So now if we put Felicia right here... There we go. Two and one. That's actually perfect. That's actually literally perfect. Literally perfect. One more. Literally one more damage. I really don't know if she's worth leveling up. I mean, we could change her class once she's all good to go. So I guess it's worth leveling her up. Why not? I don't know if changing her class will get rid of aptitude, though. You guys can let me know in the comment section below for sure if that is the case. So that I don't go and ruin my entire game. Because I know that you're supposed to use this girl for uh, specific reasons. But look at all the, look at all those stats. She can, she can get really good, I feel like. Okay, so we gotta wait again. We gotta go for the bait, bait ball. Let's go like this. Throw Arthur behind you. Wait one more time. This should be the last unit that we bait. Evil shall not prevail. And I like them together, so that would be great if they, if they ended up wanting to make a little baby or two. Uh. You can come through now. Get the extra, get that extra delicious, nutritious. Stop with your knees buckling. You are, you are brave. You are great. You're awesome. I hope she holds aptitude forever. I really hope that's, that's the case. Oh my gosh, they're all in love. They're all falling. They're all falling. All right, we can bring Arthur over here now. We can actually uh, get a level up for Elise as well because she was just on the tippy, 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 tippy iceberg leveling up. And we got it. Lowly, freaking sweet. I uh, really love it. And we can start bringing Effie over because, like I said, Effie is our is our hitmonger. She takes the hits. It would be so poetic if I can actually make it so that uh, Mozu gets the kill here. Uh, it kind of would be... It would just be ideal, honestly. It would make me really happy. I could separate them, for sure. Um, I don't see the point just yet. Let's see. Okay, this is going to deal zero, but it's going to reduce your... This is going to deal six. Okay, so we're going to reduce your defense and then go in. 
So deal seven, you'll do five times two, that's fine. Okay, let's reduce your defense first. I'm really hoping this guy stays put no matter what, because I don't know if I'm gonna be able to kill him this turn. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to kill him right away, but this is gonna lower his defense, which is really all that matters. Um, so deal 11, and we take nine. So 11, 20, uh, 10, so that's 30, and then can you deal three? You deal two. Oh, we're shy by one for her getting the KO. Well, let's play it out, because maybe we're not. Maybe once people pair up, we'll be fine. Oh, let's rock out, let's just rock out. No matter what, we'll take this thing out, even if we have to use Shady, but I'd really like it if Mozu got the, got the kill for this. Just because, I think it's poetic. This was a lot of experience that went to Mozu, for sure. Oh, this is gonna deal 14. Okay, so I didn't account for that, that's for sure. Everything will be fine. There we go. All he does is crit, 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 no matter what. He got critting on his mind, he can never get enough. He did not care about poetry. He did not care about poetry. Poetry wasn't in his mind. He did not care. He got a crit when he was supporting Arthur. Are we serious? I wanted poetry, he wanted bloodshed. Oh my gosh. All right, we finished off the last All of the right. faceless. Mozu, um, but what do I do now? They took my mother, my life. You must have some family near here. We'll be glad to take you there. There's no one. I couldn't even start over here by myself. All the homes, fields, it's all destroyed, but I wouldn't want to stay here even if it wasn't. Everyone I called family is dead. Every house, a grave. Listen, we'll take you in. We can't replace all those you've lost, but we'll take care of you. I can join your group? Yes, but only until yeah. we find you a safe place to call home. Our group, a family of sorts, is bound by a dangerous cause. We go from one battle to the next, ever in peril. That's no life for you. I'm not afraid. I can help. I might even save you or your friends. Let me join your cause, whatever it is. I'll keep your family alive. Yes, of course. Yeah. I have to admit, you sound just like one of us already. I'll do my best, do and my I'll stay best. safe. After all, Mother's watching over me now. All of our moms are dead. This is so sad. This is so sad. But we rocked that chapter, or that paralogue. Um, now let's just see if she's around. Can I invite her to my quarters? Lilith's temple again. Can I feed you again? I did get meat times two. Oh, we have cabbage as well. Resistance nutrients. No, we'll just go strength. You, we'll just go strength for now. Cause meat seems to be what Lilith actually likes. I don't know that cabbage is what she will dig. I don't know if she'll dig that. Is that a level up? I still don't know when Lilith comes into play. Like when do I get to take her into battle? Do I actually get to take her into battle at all? Thank you, I feel more powerful now. I'd like to offer thanks. Please take this gift. You got a gold bar? Hashtag gold bars. Oh, there she is. Seems like a good day for a long nap under a tree somewhere. Oh, you wanna come over? That's what that sounded like to me. All right, so staff store. Oh, Effie runs the staff store, that's awesome. Oh my gosh. Okay, who are you buying for? So if I pick Shady. Wow. Okay, so the tonics are just for one battle, which Promotes a base class at level 10 or higher to an advanced class. Oh. Heart seal changes the unit's class based on personality. Level stays the same. Changes the unit's class based on S rank support. Friendship seal changes the unit's class based on A plus. Ooh, okay, I like that. That's cool, that's cool, that's cool. Um, we, could, we could buy more freezes, which is awesome. So we're actually gonna buy for a lease. Let's definitely buy a freeze. 1800, but it's so worth. You only get to use it four times though, but it is broken. Man. All right, let's buy it. Can I sell that gold bar to you? Sell, okay. Let me sell that gold bar for three. That's all you get is 300? All right. How else are we getting gold, Thanks. like in this game? Can I invite someone to my quarters now? Oh, let's see. Oh, wow, there's something weird here. Consider it a present for me. We got berries. Right now, I'm taking inventory for a weapon. Want a want weapon shop? Want to help? I love that there's this aspect to the game. Invite an ally. Oh, I already know who I'm inviting. What I can't invite? Oh, I can't invite Mozu. Yes, definitely. They worked hard together. Your room is so fancy. Thanks for letting me look around. I've been pulling my own weight around here. Oh yes, you have. Oh yes, you have. <laughs> 
Moves left in high spirits. What's my level with her? Well, I have to. I guess I have to go back to the castle and do the interactions. The support interactions. Support? You're talking to Mosey right now. Are you already S rank? Now what should I do with these veggies? Boil them or, or I could pickle them? Gosh, just thinking all about all I could do is making me tingly inside. Hi Mosey, you seem to be in high spirits. Goodness, that's a tall stack of boxes. Are all of those filled with produce? Sure are. You seem to have your hands full. Can I help you with those? Sure, just be careful. I don't want any of these precious babies getting bruised. Okay, one, two, three, lift! God, to oh my back! That's literally me. Hey, just, just set it down careful, I'll take care of it. Oh, he had me going there. You're weaker than you look, Lord Shady. I don't think it's that I'm weak as so much as that you're shockingly strong. You, what, are, what, just, what are you implying? Sorry, I just meant it as a compliment. No offense intended. Where do you get all these vegetables anyway? From a village I visited a little while back. I helped some of the grannies on the farm there and made a few friends. <laughs> That's always nice. I worked in the fields every day back home, so I'm used to putting in some elbow grease. Hmm. Mozu, something wrong? Nah, it's nothing. Do you miss your old life? Of course not, the very idea. I'm grateful for all you did for me, Lord Shady. And you know, I'm no weakling, so don't worry about me, okay? Point well taken. Uh, anyway, what should we make with all these veggies? Maybe I should go around and ask people what kind of things they'd want. See you, Lord Shady. Mozu, I don't think there's anything that can stop me from worrying about you. Oh. <laughs> that made me, what the heck? Why am I such an emotional human being? That literally, like, look at my eyes. That was instant. All right, whatever. Hoo ha wa! Effie, will you put me down, please? I don't want to be your dumbbell anymore. Ah, oh, but you're perfect weight. Okay, I'll set you down. Watch your feet, milady. No need to be so formal, Effie. It's just the two of us. Yes, mil. Okay, Elsie. Elise. <laughs> Say, do you remember how we met? Of course I do. You snuck out of the castle and came to play in the underground city. Yep, I was sick of being in that stuffy old castle. I wanted to make a new friend, a real one. I'd never have guessed that muddy little girl was our princess. If we hadn't gone back up to the capital, you probably never would have found out, huh? It's weird to think about what might have happened. Yes, it would have changed the entire course of my life, but we did go up and those guards found us. I tried so hard to protect you, but they were too much for me. I was only a child. I might have been locked away forever if you hadn't told them who you were. <laughs> so yes, we sure showed them. They got so scared. That was the day I swore to I'd protect you for the rest of my life, no matter what. Yup, I remember it like it was yesterday. Thank you for always being there for me, Effie. They obtained level B, which is great. So Arthur and Effie can talk. Greetings, Effie. Can you spare a moment to discuss something of dire importance? Arthur, what's going on? Is Lady Elise okay? Ha <laughs> ha! Yes, of course. I didn't mean to alarm you. Sorry, but what I say may what I say next may shock and disturb you to your very core. Well, what are you waiting for? Effie, I believe we need to have a chat. We are having a chat right now! Now will you hurry up and get to the point? Certainly, Effie. I believe that I am falling behind in my Elise guarding duties. I see your dedication to her in every aspect of your life, and I am envious. Please, I must know your secret. There's no secret. But what you said about my dedication is accurate. I'm more than just her retainer. I'm her best friend. Everything I do is for her. But that doesn't mean you should feel bad. You're her hero. You're, you're her hero, you know. It warms my ears to hear such praise, but I fear it is not enough. Our battles grow fiercer by the day. I must know the secrets of your strength. Oh, well, my strength comes from my training. You're welcome to join me for a workout or a sparring session anytime. Fantastic. I look forward to battling to the death. What? Of my energy. To the death of my energy. Is that not a common expression? Oh, my mistake. I like Arthur. He's a, he's a funny guy. He really does remind me of um of Armstrong. So we're actually going. It looks like I'm, I'm assuming we'll advance to chapter nine now. I don't think there'll be another paralogue. I'm guessing. No, there's not. Okay, so we'll go to chapter eight. Would you like to proceed to the next battle? It's about to get real in here. It's about to get real chilly. Cold reception. <laughs> uh, it's much colder than in the forest. The ice trap lives up to its name. Too true. The colder it gets, the closer we are. It won't be long now. My word, isn't it? Isn't this cold air marvelous? It really puts a spring in your step. Marvelous isn't exactly the word I had in mind. I can hardly feel my fingers move anymore. They'll be frozen before long. Oh, really? I'm sorry, my liege. I had no idea you were suffering. Um, how about we try running? Maybe that will warm you up. Come on, everyone. Let's run. She's so fast. Felicia, wait for me. Lady Elise, slow down. You mustn't get ahead of the group. They're gone. This won't end well. Oh. A blizzard. A snowstorm. A whiteout. Batch Pokemon. Well... The snow is really coming down all of a sudden. Is everyone okay? I believe so, but it looks yes. like we've been separated from the others. Damn, you're right. We have to find them and quickly. Don't worry, Shady. Everything Felicia knows fine. this area well, so they should be fine. Honestly, I'm more concerned about the two of us. We must keep pushing forward before we freeze to death. Very true. We, yes. we better hurry before the path Felicia showed us is covered in snow. Wow. Okay, so we're making things interesting already with the snow. 
I can dig that. I can dig it. Call me Dig Dug. Call me Diglet. Call me Shovel Knight, which is another series on the channel. If you haven't given it a chance, maybe you should. Shameless plug. Shady Lady and I have a lot of fun with that series, honestly. It's freezing, and now the snow's so thick I can hardly see anything. Felicia said it gets colder the closer you get to the Ice Tribe Village. We must be on the right track, right, Silas? Uh, so it would seem. We must carry on. But my mind yeah. is suddenly hazy, and I can't feel my legs. Shady! I'm so sorry, Silas. I'm, I'm fine, really. I just fell a little. No big deal. Are you sleepy? I'm suddenly... So very sleepy. Shady, no, please stay no with me. You must not fall asleep. I'll get up soon, at least just five more minutes. Xander can wait. Shady! Shady! Halt, who goes there? You. What the? You. So what happened if Silas had died during that episode? Now he's just watching over me like a freak. Oh, oh. Shady, thank goodness. For a while there, I thought I'd lost you. Silas, what happened? I remember falling and then everything went black. More importantly, where are we? You're safe now, young Whoa. traveler. Welcome to my village. I am Kilma, leader of the Ice Tribe. Kilma, thank you for your kindness. It would seem you saved my life. My name is Shady. I am the second prince of the kingdom of N. Shady, you should rest now. You've had a long day. Silas, there's something the matter. My apologies, Kilma. Shady just woke up. His mind is still foggy. Perhaps you would allow him to rest a bit before we resume the introductions. Yes, of course. I'll go prepare something warm to drink. Please excuse me. Silas, what was that all about? I feel fine. Don't forget yourself, my lord. It could prove deadly. Oh, I know all of this is new to you. Don't forget we came to suppress a rebellion. That means the Ice Tribe is disgruntled with the actions of the Kingdom of Nor. In other words, we are their enemy. To identify yourself as a Norian prince, especially while in a weakened state, it's simply a bad idea, old friend. Sound advice, Silas, you're right. I forgot myself for a moment. Understandable, for one who barely made it back to the land of the living. But we must exercise caution, or neither of us will see home again. There, there's such a fine line between friend and foe. War and peace, it's all so... gray. Here are the ocean's gray waves. Such is the world we live in, I'm afraid. I must say, you truly have a remarkable knack of getting in trouble, for getting in trouble. I never thought this would, this is how we'd breach the village, but what should we do now? Ha <laughs> ha, fresh pot of hot tea is promised. This should help clear your head. Th thank you very much. You know, I usually would not allow strangers into my village like this. However, I made an exception for you two. It's that sword you carry, Shady. That golden blade looks just like that of a hero of legend. It is said the one who wields that blade is destined to save the world. My Yato, a legendary sword. Well, it's a nice thought. As you can imagine, I simply couldn't abandon you after I saw that blade. Who knows, maybe you are the cure our world has been waiting for. If so, then there's a chance we will one day break free from those cruel Norians. Uh, if you'll excuse me, I believe I've babbled on about old Ice Tribe legends long enough. Ah, it looks like my daughter has finally arrived. Allow me to introduce you. Shady? Is that you? What the? Flora, what are you doing here? I could ask you the same thing. And I shall. Why are you here, my liege? My liege? This uh, isn't good. Uh, Brother, yay! I knew you'd make it! Elise! What a relief! I was so worried once I realized we had gotten separated. Flora! What are you doing here? You told me you were going to hold down the fort while I was gone. I changed my mind. Why did you and the others follow me here? Follow you? No way! We had no idea you were even here! Yeah, that's right! We got here all by ourselves! We can't go back until we suppress the Ice Tribe Rebellion like Father ordered, even though I probably shouldn't be saying this! What?! Elise, why would you say that, huh? What do you mean? It's not a secret. Wait, doesn't suppress mean, you know, that we ask them to please stop rebelling and maybe eat dinner together? Elise, you don't understand. It's not that easy. All has become clear as ice. You monsters tricked me into helping you so you could infiltrate my village. I promise you, that was not our intention. Don't play dumb. Such childish games do not benefit a prince, even one of Nor. I know you Norians op- I know how you Norians operate. Operate, so be it. Flora, you know what must be done. Yes, father. I just connected the fact that that's his daughter! The Norians have infiltrated our village and they must be expelled immediately and permanently. For how could you say such a dreadful thing? Fighting was supposed to be a last resort. Can't we talk this out or at least try to? Felicia, dear Felicia? sister, you've always been ignorant to the ways of the Norians. War is the only language they understand. Side with them and you'll pay the price. That could have gone better. Be on your guard, Shady. So we about to get into this. I'm gonna straight up 
All right. Oh. That's not fun. I can only use six units. Who do I leave behind? Definitely not Effie. It might be Arthur. I feel like it's it's one as like Arthur without a doubt. Yeah. It's Arthur without a doubt because I need to build. Oh, this is gonna suck, man. This is gonna be bad. What was that? Live to serve. When healing an ally. Oh, that's right. Okay. So we saved. We're good to go. Let's try fighting. Uh, this might be one of those we try at Kilma. The time has come to defeat the Norian army. Inform the villagers. Sounds like Kilma's dead set on calling in reinforcements from the village. Maybe if we get to them first, we can dissuade them from fighting. Visit the villagers' house to earn a reward once the battle has concluded. Visit at least three out of the five homes to earn the best reward. Okay. So our goal, we have mixed goals. Visit villages. Um, who is this? She looks like an actual, oh, that's Flora. Why, let me just see something. Am I supposed to, I can't talk to her, okay. So I can't talk to her, can Felicia talk to her? To convince her to come over to our side, that's kind of what I'm guessing. Nope, okay, can't do that. She is definitely on the other side. So I can use anyone to talk, I'm guessing. So let's visit with Mozu. Whoa, a soldier, what's going on? Huh, don't leave my house today. Well, if you say so, I'll tell my family. Done, easy. Nailed it. I really wish I would have applied my movement speed to uh, Effie. I'm gonna keep them close together. Oh, this is kind of unfortunate going this route. I think I should head, I think I should make everyone head north. No, I think, I think that the pact of three can go this way. And this pact of three can go this way. That should be fine. All right, we can get in there pretty soon actually. We can get in there pretty soon, into that village. Oh, no, wait. So now we can't. Oh, that stinks. Oh! The darkness is calling, whispering, seething, it's saying, hmm, I understand. The shadows within say our foes are unwitting yet dangerous. So it has been decided by the treacherous hand of fate. We have no choice. We must use the darkness swarming inside me to claim the golden glow of victory. You're a damn weirdo, Odin. But you know what? You know that, don't you? In any case, I'm not gonna let you take all the glory for yourself, huh? What's going on over there? Who are you? Didn't you hear me about the darkness? Sheesh, some people are so rude. Well, it can't be helped. Who am I, you ask? I am none other than Odin Dark. I am the keeper of the darkness, chosen protector of the youngest Norian prince. So, you're Leo's retainer, and he sent you here to help me? Yes, that would be the same version of what Odin just said. My name is Niles, by royal decree of Lord Leo, I am here to serve you. Serve me? I would rather you fight at my side as a friend and equal. Now, don't worry about Niles, he's always like this. I suspect he's bitter that the dark spirits chose, chose to inhabit me and not him. But back to the matter at hand, don't be afraid, Lord Shady. I will now use my powers to expel those who wronged you from this world. Ah, the power my fell hand awakens. It longs for the blood of our foes. And I must annihilate them all or the curse will surely- Whoa there, take it easy. Let's all just calm down, all right? What, why, but by, by my sword, the curse, what's the holdup? Is there a problem? When can we start inflicting pain? Um, no offense. I'm happy you came to help and all, but you're creeping me out. Besides, I would like to settle this dispute with as little as bloodshed as possible. So we can inflict pain as long as it doesn't cause bloodshed. Interesting challenge. I really like this guy. No, just no. But I prepared at least a dozen torturous moves just for today. I named them all too. They might be my best names yet. I'm, I'm very sorry for the, uh, inconvenience, but I'm gonna have to put my foot down. Well, if it's an order from the from my liege's royal sibling, I am obliged to obey. I may appear to be somewhat despicable, but I have the utmost loyalty for Lord Leo. I too am a bastion of loyalty, despite the dark forces that beckon me from beyond. It will be hard to hold back my true power, but for you, I'll see what I can do. Thank you, gentlemen. Now, let's finish this quickly. Okay, I'm really mad that I can't go to this village, so I have to try to, oh, man, I'm definitely gonna be replaying this chapter then. Like, how am I to, everyone's in danger right now. And these guys shoot from far away. I'm guessing you shoot from far away as well, though. Six, it's thunder versus thunder. And his thunder is so much stronger. I might, oh my gosh, this stinks. This is no good. They're about to just join up soon anyway. Can I pair, I can pair up? Oh, I can pair up. They're pairing up right now. Oh my gosh, there's just too many of them up here. 19, okay, that's completely worth. Oh wait, I'm taking 11. That was not worth. That was not worth. That was not worth. Uh, 
I 100% lied. Oh no, this is not good. No, I don't want to staff you. What if, what if I just want you guys to pair up? Oh no. I think they just made a huge mistake. Look at all the units they have. I thought Effie would be able to take a hit so much better. We'll see how this goes. Something tells me I'm gonna be restarting this chapter like right away. Like I'm just gonna be restarting in the middle of this episode. Seventeen plus ten, so we can take you out. All right, that's worth. That's worth. We're gonna call worth on that one. Being able to take one of them out is worth. Um, because they can hit from a range and they might be able to take Effie out if I don't do that. So let's see if we can possibly. It stinks because I went up here to visit the village so that they wouldn't get reinforcements and there's just no way of doing that. Like, that's not possible. All right, I kind of want to put one of them in harm's way. I don't know if I want it to be you, though. No, it's not going to be you. We're going to wait it out. I'm really curious. What is this? Is this it? Melt the ice to make a lake for one turn. Wait. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That would make all of this a lake? Oh, that was a dragon's vein. I just gargled so hard. Okay. Wait, what was that? Was that support that I could have done? Okay. 16 plus 8. We have a good chance of dodging. We're not going to dodge. We're going to take a lot of damage. I really hope you don't knock out Silas because we are definitely, we are just going to have to... 64% chance. Come on, dodge. All right, so I'm gonna do what I did last time. I'm gonna try to play through the chapter and then I'll have to do it off screen, uh, potentially. Ah, man, Silas, this is so much damage too. I guess really there's no point in continuing. If, if, my, if my intention is to replay the chapter anyway, uh, to hold on to my units, I might as well do it now. Right? I think that makes the most sense. Because we're not far. We're on turn three. Do you guys concur? You're not here to concur. Let me get some more information before I do this. What happens when I use this dragon's vein? So all of that's going to become a lake. Do they all just get... Did you truly manage to melt the lake's ice with the power of dragon's vein? Well, it was all for nothing. The sacred land is blessed with divine protection. By the power of the ice dragon, our lake will freeze once more. Oh, they don't... I thought they would, like, drown or something. Oh, that's a shame. Okay. Uh, let's see how much damage each of these guys do. Six plus nine. You deal nothing to me? Iron Dagger. Wow. That is straight crazy. That is nuts. Okay. So let's move... Oh, man. Oh, because it's a lake now. I'm foolish. Let's see how much you do. Twelve. Okay, so you can body him. All right. So these two new guys that end up coming are really good. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to restart right now. We're not going to, I'm not going to waste my time and your time. I'm not going to run through half this chapter. If my intent is to restart and keep my units at least until chapter 10, um, I'm down to do that. I think after chapter 10, when a unit dies, uh, we're just going to rock out with it. Let me select my units. Cause I think, okay. So we can skip, we can skip. Uh, we will have Mozu. Actually, what we could do is we could have them join up right away. Have Shady visit. Now that I know that that top route is going to... Um, there's no way to reach that village in time. I'm just going to ignore it. I'm just going to ignore it completely. And continue over this way. I don't see a reason to to do anything. Like, to, to, to bother going north. He's going to get villagers right away. A bunch of them as well. We have to get over to that town. We already did that whole spiel. That's great. I can... We can't move over there just yet. So you'll be able to like, okay, you don't do that much for some reason. I don't know what it was that made you do so much before. And Effie clearly does not like magic, which there are two magic users up here that came out of there. Tribalists. Those are no good for us. That's for certain. What's a guide? Why is there an explanation point? I don't know. I really don't know. It's saying guard one left. Who's left? Who have I not used? Oh, that's right, you. 
That's fine. That is absolutely fine. Okay, so they're gonna come closer, which is which is good. I mean, it's bad, but it's good. We have to try to body all these guys, like, right now. 16 plus 9. Did turning it into a lake, like, make them more vulnerable? That might have been what it did. If I go there, then you can attack me, and you can you can't attack me. Okay. So I'm fine with Effie going there. I actually would rather prefer... Okay, we're definitely gonna Dragon Vein it up. We're gonna Dragon Vein, because clearly, clearly when they're on the lake, they take a lot more damage. They take a lot more damage when they're on the lake. Uh, I'm guessing that's what lake does. I wish I could see the stats. Oh, it, it is right there. Okay, so if we were to go right here, now we do so much damage. And they can't attack while they're on the lake. So 612, that's enough to take him out. That's 23, that's incredible. So that's completely worth. Yeah, 612. Wait, no, that's 19. That's not enough to take him out. I'm being a fool. I still think that's our best option. Take this, well, do as much damage as I can to this guy. You're gonna deal one to me? And I'm actually gonna get hit. I'm actually gonna get hit. With a 45% chance to hit. Okay. 24. That might be worth. Let's see. 6. 13. That'll take him out. I think that's worth. I think that's worth. I think just taking him out is completely fine. We're gonna take zero damage, miss, and oh, it's beautiful. That is beautiful. I love archers so much. I love mages and archers. So what I could do is I could bring you up here, and that should be. I was gonna say. I would say the combination of Silas and Effie is just too strong. Too strong for sure. Thank you. Thank you. Absolutely love this game. I can play this game forever. In fact, it, it, it fourth wall broken. Uh, I've been playing for an hour straight. It's 11 o'clock and I don't want to stop. Can't stop, won't stop, honestly. All right. I'm guessing you can't really deal too much damage. Uh, I could heal you up and support. I think if I, yeah, okay. I think that should be fine. It should be fine. Get a nice little heal on. Now, can I use you to attack anyone? I really can't. That's a shame. I might want you to go north, though, because east, there's not too much going on. But I don't want you in the line of fire, so we'll just put you there. All right, that's what the enemy does. 11 damage this guy wants to do. Can you dodge? You're not going to dodge. And you're going to get completely destroyed. Uh, it's going to freeze again. That stinks. Uh, that was definitely great advantage for us. Oh, this is just gonna, this would body him? Just outright, out of the gate? I mean, we're gonna take one or, we're gonna take three damage at most. I think mean, we're just gonna take one. Yo, this archer is a baller. I mean, I'm falling in love with, look at that jump! I'm falling in love with these characters more and more and more and more and more. Like, I can use you north or east. I think I want to send Shady East. Ugh, I wish you could just walk one more. I would let her get the get the experience. Well, this will give Odin some good. I love I love mages. I really do. Well, I like Odin's cloak. Like I love mages, so I'm totally down. Oh, and his voice actor is golden. That's another dragon's vein. All right, we're gonna start heading all over here. Um, Effie's in the line of fire if she stays where she is, I believe. Yes, she is. So we're gonna move Effie. We're gonna move Effie right here because I don't mind if she's in the line of fire. I don't mind if she's in the line of fire, uh, from Axeman. I don't mind that. Although Axe does beat Lance, which is super unfortunate for us. 
I might actually pair these two up. Yeah, I'm gonna pair them up. I'm gonna pair them up. Wait, what? Oh, freeze. Wow. All right, we can dodge, we can dodge. That's what I'm talking about. 21! No! He's gonna get here. All right, I have to freeze, I have to freeze. I don't have freeze? Oh, he's just out of my range. Oh, it's gonna suck. I have to, I have to get to three. I have to get, I did one, two, and I have to get here. And there's no way I'm gonna get north. There's no way I'm gonna get north in time. Oh, I really want, I really want the, the high reward. What are you doing, computer? I really want the high reward. We're gonna have to save this for the next episode. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please show some shady love to that thumbs down below. Your support means absolutely everything on this series. It's not the most watched series, but right now it's my most enjoyed series that I'm doing. Uh, well, no, I, there's so many that I enjoy. I love, I'm loving all the content I'm putting out, actually. I can't even say that. Have yourselves a good day, but above all else, keep it shady.